This your boy Andre, back with another video. We made it to the Mound House. We are looking at uh, the area is occupied by the Calusa, the Calusa Indians. There's a um, shell mound as well, I believe, that's out here with artifacts. But we made it to Fort Myers Beach, Florida. So let's begin the journey. I hope you guys like the YouTube video. All right, you guys, I'm walking the Indian Trail right now. I think that's the museum house as well. Remember, they was occupied by the Calusa Indians. I don't think that museum is open right now. Yeah, I'm going to talk about your ass on my Instagram. This one. I think that's the museum up there. I'm going to check that out. Remember, this site belongs to the Calusa Indians. We are at the Mount House. I don't know exactly where the mountain is, but I'm going to walk this whole park. The Calusa, I think these are the Tequesta tribe. But let me get a little closer and I will break down the video of the areas I'm walking into. Okay, you guys, I don't know exactly where the, um, the Indian mountain at. I'm going to walk the park a little longer. But remember, this site belongs to the Calusa. I think these are the Tequesta tribe, but under a different name. I believe they are related to the Tequesta Indians. The Calusa... Uh, I can't remember too many tribe names. Tequesta. I've been to the Miami Circle as well. That's pretty awesome. But this is a monument of the Spaniard contact. I think the Spaniard and Europeans made contact with the Calusa at this site as well at the Mound House. Yeah, this is Calusa artifacts right here. The Calusa, like other natives, culture travel Florida. They got canoes. The canoes were hard crave by using fire and shells. That's pretty awesome. That's interesting right there. But yeah, they got monuments all over this place. Hope you got, I'm hoping I'm not moving too fast. I'm trying to make it to the other Indian mounds as well. I guess this is a bird sanctuary. I guess you could find these birds out here. The Calusa was more of a hunting and gathering tribe. Remember, there is a museum. If you guys come out here, there is a museum out here as well. I think it's like $10 to get in. So they got like little monuments of the sea life that comes and show up every now and then. You got dolphins, stingrays, manatees. I'm going to try to go into the museum as well and document a few things, let you guys see that. So let's continue to walk. I think I got like um, six other Indian mounds I got to go to. This area was used by indigenous people though. I'm showing you proof that everybody do not come from Africa. Please. It's not talking about nothing too much. But yeah, we at the Mound House. I can't believe I made it here. Man, you guys gotta start traveling. So I don't know what I'm finna do right now, I'm finna walk more uh, around the park. And I'm gonna cut the video straight. I meant cut the video short for now. Sorry about that. 
No swimming, no cleaning fish. There's a manatee sanctuary over here in this area. So they take the manatees, it's life serious, by keeping the area clean. So I'm finna go check out the museum. See, look, what is the mound made of? This mound is made of seashells, I believe. I think where we standing, if you look over there, I think that's the mound right there on top of the house. I'm not sure, I'm gonna go look, but. Just showing you information about the mound that was built with shells, seashells. I think they use it for ceremony purposes as well. But let's continue the video. All right, you guys, so we're gonna walk around the museum. I'm, I'm gonna try to go into the museum. It's $10, so I'm gonna check that out. But this is like another Indian trail. This is the territory. Remember, we at the mound house. You guys got to get out and travel. This place is awesome. I never have either. Not once have I been bothered by smoke here. Follow This place is cool. All right, so let's go into the museum, but I'm going to cut the video short. There's another money man or the Calusa, the Calusa tribe. There's a story beneath our feet. It's pretty awesome. I'm gonna come out here. I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna buy me a ticket and see what this is all about. So let's continue the video. So let's take a closer look. This is the museum. This is the Calusa Museum. So let's take a look. I'm going to let you guys view the whole museum. This house is still in its natural. Since it's been built, the natural way since, the, since it's been built. I don't know what year this house is, but this house look old. So let's look at the monument right here. And it's another hunting house place in, um, on Key Biscayne where a second Seminole War had broke out. They call this the Mound House Bricks. I find it interesting to have a house built near a mound i seen a few houses built on top of a mound in Florida. They call it Mound Florida Drive or something like that. I'm not sure. But yeah, this place is pretty cool. All right, let me go back a little further more. So I'm finna try to go into the museum and record inside and let you guys see this. All right, so let me go buy my ticket. I'll be back with a second video. All right, you guys, I'm in the museum. This is what they discovered at the Mound House. Oh man, it's pretty awesome. Early settlement. That ship we seen is still out there on the water. Man, this place is awesome. I'm not gonna say too much. I wanna be a little quiet in the museum. 
Let me go back a little bit more. So let's walk to the other side. They found pottery here, all type of stuff. This place is awesome. This pottery from the Calusa. Hope you guys like this YouTube video. I'm traveling in the Florida coast right now. Also, I'm gonna go to the downtown Miami History Museum. It's artifacts they found at the Miami Circle. The authentic mass from the Calusa. The Calusa are very similar from the Tequesta. They believed in animal spirits, worshiping the sun, and paying homage to trees, I believe. best not to make this video too long but you guys gotta start traveling man this is awesome this is awesome European encounters it's funny how history tells us who our enemies are if you go back and do the research You'll know who the enemies is. Okay, you guys, I'm on the second floor. I guess these are some more artifacts about plants. Hope you guys can see it. And the ship we seen is right there. That ship been here for a long time. It's like everything is still the same out here. But remember, this is the Mound House. I will be going to Tallahassee Indian Mounds. I'm going to go through Tampa right now. I just wanted you guys to see this. We all going to travel together if y'all follow my channel. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Here comes some more to catch the mask. Here come an alligator mask. Wow. That's amazing. Crazy. Alright, so let's go around here. All right, I'm finna come down now. All right, this is the monument of the manatees, waterfront creatures. Man, this place is amazing. But I'm finna cut the video short. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. But we're going to the next Indian mound. I think it's going to be a temple. All right, so let me let you guys see this mask one more time. That's it.